Hello, I'm Miriam, co-founder and COO of Keto Chow. I'm Chris, also a co-founder, president, and the technical guy behind Keto Chow. Uh, if you're brand new to Keto Chow, it's a nutritionally complete meal designed to make doing keto easy. We also have some electrolyte supplements that are amazing for everyday use and for keeping the dreaded keto flu away. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the little bell icon for daily updates on all our Keto Chow happenings. These live streams help us be accountable and stay on track. Thanks so much for joining us on our Keto Chow. Ding, ding. Ding, ding. <laughs> all right. Bumpy. So we got Catherine on says, I can't figure out how to use my reward points. Can um, you show us? Yeah. Now with the new website. It's a little slow. And we do actually have, let's see if I Google Keto Chow Rewards. You got a T in there. I bet you Google will figure it out. Good anyway. job, Google. Google de Google. Turn rewards and purchases. So you need to log into your account. Mm -hmm. And across the top, there will be a earn, history, earn points, and my rewards. When you go into my rewards, you can click on the thing that you want. And there should be, actually, I'm not sure if that box is in the new checkout. Guess we should find out. Yes. So there should be a box that you enter that in the, the current shopping cart. Uh, I guess we can just check out really quick. I want to be caught up on everything. Uh, chocolate toffee is the flavor of the week, by the way. You should try that. And cart. View cart. Oh, look how cute that picture is. View cart. And it's right here. There it is. Yay. So the code that you get from the uh, rewards program just goes into that box right there. So we should take a new screen capture. We should. Thing. Note to self. So that's how you use it. Um, let's see. Debbie is on. So is Randy um, and Becca. Um, Randy says the 2KK video with Dr. Barry was really good last night. Yes, it was. It was. Uh, let's see. Gina says, good morning, everyone. Uh, listening at work. Happy Friday. Susan B is on. Uh, Teresa says, good morning. Wonderful people. Uh, let's see, Elizabeth is morning. Good morning. Good all. morning, Elizabeth. Matre is on. Hi, Matre. Kimberly says, hey, guys. Uh, Shauna says, good morning, Chris. And hey, Shauna. Sonia, Sonia says, sound. Sound. Looks like it's working. Do we have some sound? Yep. I was on um, Autumn's and my <laughs> phone connected to your car. Yes, it did. Drive, going to drive away. No, it was my car uh, turning on the uh, environmental systems mm -hmm. on schedule. And which it that's done that a couple of times actually yeah, it it decided it wants to connect to your phone yeah, it likes me becky is on says what's up family hi miriam chris hi, red wine is on from in louisville sorry louisville i uh, will be heading home in a few days nice uh, okay. let's see ba -ba -ba. mj says i'm here hi good marcy says good morning everyone lisa says hey y'all i just watched the fifth episode yeah so and this seems to come up every time we talk about it. So I'm going to show you guys the easiest way to watch reversed. Okay. So you got a your health why network you are. Home, why you are. Once you log in or create an account, you can go into reversed. And there's episode five. I wonder if we're in it again this time. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Kim says, you Lisa's race those waves. I bet you Lisa is in it. Lisa says, good morning. Mm -hmm. Headed to Colorado Springs today to visit my son. Oh, Kino Chow okay. and a new creamy package are ready to go. Nice. I had chocolate. I, last night, just before we went to bed, I mm -hmm. made four chocolate keto chows oh. and put them all into the creamy things. Nice. And I had a meal prep. That's right. I was thinking about stealing some of your hamburgers for breakfast. Uh, that's why I made extras. Yeah. Or talking you into taking me to dinner tonight, and then I would just not have breakfast. Mm -hmm. Sonny says, Miriam, your hair looks fabulous. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Blue says, can rewards codes be gifted to another person to use towards their order? Yes, they can. Yes. They're not linked to you, but they are only good once. once. So you can't use it and the other person use it. Or yes. also, if they put it in and then the order gets refunded or there's any kind of problems with it, then they would have to do the like customer support to be able to figure that out. So that maybe would make it weird. But. Yep. I don't know says good morning from the super spectacular Keto Chow storefront. Yes. And it's Lynette's 100th day at keto, or 12 month at Keto Chow. Oh, 
There's a big difference. Keto Chow anniversary. Keto Chow anniversary. Mm -hmm. Has it only been in a year? Yeah. Seems like longer than that. I know. That. I'm glad she's in my uh, Because you're loving those natural locks, Miriam, Gorge. Oh, I thought you were talking about me. My hair is just this straight all of the time. Yeah. <laughs> Elizabeth says, so far, my dad likes all the flavors he's tried, and my latest A1C is now 5.2. Yay. Yay. Renee says, my order's on its way. Good morning. J Dog is on also. Good morning. Mimi says, hello, everyone. Uh, let's see. Hoopcat says, happy Friday, everyone. Hi, Hoopcat. Becky says, it's whispery. Is What's it whispery? whispery? Oh, our talking? It should mm -hmm. be. We have the things on, right? Here is the... Let's see if it's whispery. That's going to the right one. Is it too quiet? I don't know. I, I'm getting a good audio level on the thing, so... Uh, Shauna says, breakfast ended up being beef, butter, bacon, eggs. Oh, brisket, <laughs> butter, burnt, ends, eggs. There you go. Heck yeah. Holly says, here's a link to the Keto Brand of the Year voting uh, keto with the Holly? Keto Weekly Ketogenic mm -hmm. Awards. So that's so fun. Lynn says, looked at the new website and confused with macros calculator. Oh, now it says, my protein is lower grams than my fat as compared to the higher protein from Maria Emmerich's calculator, which I do higher protein. Okay, well, we'll have to check out the calculations. Yeah, on we'll that. look at that. And Last time I looked, it was getting the right results. Um, but we'll have to check on that. Betsy says, good morning, Chris and Miriam. Uh, Becky says, the reverb needs adjusting. Uh, it doesn't have a reverb setting. So I'll have to, let me see something really quick. Fossils. Yours. It's hiding. No, that should be. Nothing's changed from yesterday. Uh, Rebecca says, good morning. MJ, oh, talking morning, to Rebecca. Elizabeth Rapalai on the A1C. Amanda says, good morning, beautiful people. Uh, Fanny says, happy Friday. Susan says, good morning to J-Dog. Marcy says, love the reverse show. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Rana says, good morning. Uh, Heath is ear hustling while I cook lunch. Nice. Shana says, it's my day to make five creamies for the freezer. It's a great day. <laughs> Chad says, hello, bears. You spelled it wrong. Hey, Chad. B-A-I-R. It's, okay. it's air with a B. <laughs> <It's okay. laughs> well, Amitreya says... Bears. Uh, certainly does seem like a good idea to have a Friday date night. Texas Roadhouse or Buffalo Wild Wings. Right. We did actually go to Buffalo Wild Wings yesterday. So Texas Roadhouse it is. Um, let's see. Bam. Becky says the sound. Matreya says audio seems fine here. Oh, okay. okay. Carol says hello from Colorado. Keto lady. I need to make uh, some more keto chow shakes today. Betsy says, my two bags of English toffee. We don't have an English toffee. Oh, we yeah. Chocolate, chocolate toffee. But that's okay. <laughs> anyway, she says they're on the way. See, how's I'm, your neck? How are you feeling, Betsy? Thinking about you. How did you not, how did you enjoy not sleeping yesterday? You not, feel better? My ankles are super swollen. Sounds like it's, it's raining. raining. <gasps> I it's hear it on the roof. Raining. Uh, let's see. Holly says, you found, sound, sound fine here. Oh, Me speak good. thank you. And thank you, Becky, for letting us know. Sometimes it is hard to tell if it's you or if it's the thing. And it's always, I always don't worry if I sound silly. I'm like, oh, I, the sound is weird, just in case. The, yep. the is Yogi? Straight I so. didn't see. Anyway. Someone said, hi there, Yogi. Anyway. Um, Becky says, nerd, nerd, nerd. Um, Donita says hello from Colorado Springs as well. Donita, how are you? Um, Debbie says ear hustling while I eat bacon and eggs at yeah, work. Yeah, and work. Nice. Oh, J Dog says Chris Yogi Bear. Uh, Yo -yogi. I never really got jokes about my last name. It, it was usually jokes about my first name. Which is funny because I always called me Christopher Columbus when I was in like first grade. I'm like, I think okay. my name wasn't one that could be made fun of. You had to do make, make it, it was too easy. hard to articulate. Miriam. Mm -hmm. So maybe they just gave up. Library is the only thing I ever Yeah, but you have to be really old, and that's Marion. I know, and I heard that too. But they would say, Marion, not a librarian. I don't know. I, I had a Spanish it, teacher who would sing it to me every day. Oh, okay. I was going to say, bullies well, that watch. Um... Kids, I do. <laughs> and then um, they would make fun of my last name, which was Printy, oh. P-R-I-N-T-Y. But there's really not very much you could make fun of that. I'm like, you work in a print shop? Like, that's scary. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, wait up. Printy, drinty, wimpy. Like, well, that's nothing. Like, I don't know. So, the takeaway from this is kids are dumb. Kids anyway, are dumb. Oh, wait. Nia says, 
Dania says, I'm using a keto chat to help my husband's Alzheimer's. Wow, that's amazing. Oh, well, good. Uh, Becky says, my volume is at max because I'm power of hearing, so it's probably just me. Okay. <laughs> well, this is I voted for Keto Chow for best product, caramel macchiato flavor. Next time I should be less specific. Oh, I saw you comment that on uh, the on Dr. Barry's stream. Well, the Two Crazy Keto stream last night. Yes. Betsy says, chocolate toffee. Hoopcat says, it's been nice being on vacation and being able to join all the lives and premieres. I hope you're having a good time. Um, Shana wants to know, how do you make chocolate toffee with, into English toffee? I... I don't think there's a way to do that. Just walk over to England? No, like making a toffee. I, uh, there's too much protein in it. Dania says, first time in the live chat. Well, welcome, by the way. j Dog was having Fruit Loops for breakfast. I believe that that's the orange, the lemon, and the strawberry mixed together. So, speaking of cereal, my dad, I texted him this morning and asked how he's doing. It's been like... Almost two weeks since he started keto. I said, "What do you What do you eat?" He's all, "Oh, lettuce wraps and cereal." I said, "What kind of cereal?" It's all raisin bran. Well, nah, nope. <laughs> That's the keto, there, buddy. Oh, yeah, I guess it wouldn't be. I said, "Start eating eggs for breakfast instead." Bacon and eggs. It's a good idea. <laughs> That's Daddy O. Mike says, "Good morning, all." Uh, Rhonda is on. Says, "Good morning, Bears and Chow Fam." Um, Gina says. I am Gina, the librarian. Oh, yes. Um, j Dog says, yogi, as in you're a keto yogi. I don't know about that. <laughs> uh, uh, Blue Dove, do you remember the show Kissy Fur? Anyway, he says, my big brother is a crisper. Called him Kissy Fur back when I was little, and my daughter called him Apple Crisp. Trying to say Uncle Chris. <laughs> That's hilarious. Jerry says, my last name was Watt. They were, all, they were always saying, What? What? Oh, yes. Very, what? very original. Yeah, I can see that. Susan says, I had all kinds of comments about my last name. It varied depending on where I was in my life. Yeah. Oh, Matreya had s'mores in her creamy. Oh, nice. That sounds great. Um, Jen says, what do y'all have all planned for the weekend? I'm getting ready for the trip next week. Mm-hmm. Yep. I brought the big tent and some cots to load into the boat. Oh, you did? Yes. Awesome. Did we accidentally get shipped an extra cot? No. Oh, I did. I bought four. I thought you bought two, and I saw three, so I was confused. Okay. That's fine. I'm the, the, fine the unopened those. box is two of them. Ah, uh, right. So. Well, that's cool. Um. Yeah. Oh, I want to say something. Go ahead. It's completely not important at all. So I'm going to clean this weekend, probably. And I did a lot of cleaning the last few days, and I feel really amazing, even though I still am not caught up with laundry. It's a lot worse. Okay. So that was awesome for me. Yay, me. <laughs> it's my birthday present to me. It's my birthday I'm present. so happy. <laughs> did Emperor's new groove. Um, yeah, aside from that, it's supposed to be raining all weekend, so yeah. I don't know how the We're kids who didn't mow the lawn this last week are going to mow the lawn. Did we tell you we found mushrooms in our lawn? We found a lot of Our mushrooms. kids were awesome, and they took care of them yesterday with bags and everything. We need to go get some kind of a anti-fungicide or whatever. Mm -hmm. Well, the problem was is they were there long enough that a bunch of kids picked them. Yeah, so they'll probably come back. And it's going to rain, so it's not the best time to apply something like that anyway. So we'll see. We'll see what Elizabeth happens. says, I got called witch because my last my name was Elizabeth, just like the main character of Bewitched. Well, Again, kids are dumb. I hated Bewitched because the introduction was a cartoon, and it was not a cartoon. A car that and I Dream of Genie. Yeah, they both were cartoons. What the heck? But they weren't really. I so let down. Anyway. That was... That was <laughs> Uh, Sean says, I always got code and math jokes with my, about my last name. Okay. Uh, Bessie says, I'm having physical problems, old age, preparing food. I wonder if I should invest in a creamy or settle for a cuisine art ice cream maker. I think the creamy uh, is a bit easier, well, quite a bit easier to use and clean. I was really surprised. And granted, I did watch a couple of videos on it before I did it, and okay. Chris had played with it. And so I kind of knew how it was going to work. So, also, he Sorry. started up on the counter, and I just pulled it out of the freezer already done and stuck it in the thing. I boop. So, it was super easy. But even, like, the re-spinning, I was a little bit nervous about, like, pulling the thing out and washing it off and putting it back in. And I was just too lazy to do that. So, I just pushed it in, and I'm like, okay. it's perfect. Yep. <laughs> so, 
I felt like it was very easy and very fast. And yes, it's noisy, but it is quite noisy. Much. The other one was noisy for 30 minutes, and this one was just a little bit more noisy for less mm -hmm. time. Uh, Julie says good morning. Um, let's see, Julie. Oh, other Julie says good morning as well. Julie Marcy Julie? Budden says my husband had to wear butter on his uniform due to misspelling. Oh, uh, Budden instead of butter. I think butter would be awesome. I could totally see that because an N and R. Actually, my kids make fun of me all the time because my R's look like V's. Yeah. Because I write it so fast that I don't actually curl over. But I could totally see an N looking like an R. Dang. Yep. Oh, he was Mr. Butter. Um, Blue Dove wanted to know if it was fairy rings or toadstools. They were black caps, I think, is what one oh, was identified. Oh, uh, what did she say? Anyway, That's Dennis says, oops, wrong video. Thank you. Um, MJ said, I had a very hairy legs and arms as a kid, and my siblings nicknamed me Harry Ho instead of oh. Mary Jo. Seriously? That's a jerk face move. Okay, one of my favorite moments on Jeopardy of all time was Ken Jennings was on his winning streak. Yes. And the, oh, the, the answer was funny. about um, someone of a questionable moral character. And Ken says, what is a hoe? Well, it was supposed, it was a, a garden implement, yeah. implement or something. Also, a, uh, yeah. Like and <laughs> Alex Rebecca is like, "What do they teach you guys in Utah?" Utah. The answer was, "What is a rake?" The rake. Yeah. I had never even heard never the term heard that rake either until that time. <laughs> yeah. Apparently, <laughs> so a funny. rake is a guy. Oh, is it? And they so they started the corollary. For females, it would be a hoe. Oh, well, that's very interesting information for today. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Blue well, says, oh, wow, that may be worse than Medusa, not name-related, bad perm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Lisa says, try growing up with the last name Gross. Oh, man, right. Yeah, I could see. Well, no kidding. Be. But she says, okay, thanks. I'm running out of counter space, but I need to eat better. And surprisingly, the... Uh, the creamy takes up very little space. He was surprised because in the video that Joe and Rachel had, he was hugging it and it just yeah. looked so huge, but I'm sure it was just where the, the thing was. But we have it next to our KitchenAid mixer and it's half the size of the, well, I, I wouldn't say half, I guess. It looks like it's half the size because I'm including the bowl. It's very narrow it's, and tall. It's tall. So I thought it wasn't going to fit on the counter. But it does. It there totally fits underneath the cabinet. It totally does. So <laughs> red wine says, "Heck, people still to this day start singing red, red wine." That have you ever heard that before? It's like, yeah, no, no never. never. You're so funny. <laughs> the yes is interested in your ice cream ma machine recommendations. If you have the two hundred dollars to invest, the creamy is probably one of the yeah, better ones. Really if cool. you don't have already yeah. a compressor ice cream maker. If uh, your funds are a bit more limited, the Cuisine Art... Freezer bowl ice cream. Yeah, the one that... Was, we actually have a video and a roundup. Mm -hmm. If you search for Keto Chow ice, ice cream, cream maker, maker roundup, you'll find the video where we show how they perform. And at the end, the recommendation is that... Uh, I think it's like a $60 mm -hmm. one from Cuisine Yeah, it's a good... It's a good product. And then we do like the compressor ice cream maker, which is a lot more expensive too. Yep. So watch the, the creamy video and the um, ice cream video, and then you'll be able to kind of make a decision on what your needs are. So that would be helpful. Yep. Fake prices. Huddly, no one ever makes jokes about my last name. <laughs> Blue says black no caps are dark fake. Get rid of those for sure. Uh, uh, let's see. Marcy says the guys at work and said butter called him Oleo for short. <laughs> uh, Debbie says, for me, arthritis, bronchitis, laryngitis. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Betsy says, Betsy Ross or Betsy Wetsy. Oh, my goodness. Those are cute, though. <laughs> MJ says, yeah, Jennings had the better answer. And well, and the whole, the audience, the crew, the, everybody, everybody laughed. Laughing. It was, he was just like, <laughs> because, you know, he he's probably our age, right? Yeah. I had, be a little bit and I'm sure he had heard the her, ho, uh, rake before, but I, I'd never, heard I had heard the, the, I'd heard rake ish, but I'd never heard of a person being return, referred to as a rake. I had only heard. Maybe because we tried to, try to stay away from those people. Maybe. And Becca says, you clearly don't read Regency romances or you Apparently. know what a rake is. Yeah. What You're correct. Is. You're correct. I do not read those. Shauna says, creamy is not much bigger than my coffee maker. It's just taller. Yeah, it's just taller. Mm -hmm. 
Brianna says, if you watch Bridgerton on Netflix, the term rake is used a lot. I'm sure. Okay, yeah. there we go. Denise Holmes says, my kids call me home. Oh. Oh, oh man. Uh, Jerry says, use a Kohl's discount for the creaming. Oh, Not a bad okay. idea. Thank you. J-Dog says, creamy is dreamy. Jill says, I grew up with Jack and Jill. Went up the hill to have a little fun. High school kids are horrible. Oh, yeah. You're not wrong. Mm -hmm. Kids are dumb. Gentry Jill says, is such a pretty name. Uh, Tia Gentry says, my last name was Marie. Having a teacher not believe you about your last name. Tia Marie? <laughs> yeah, that's my last name. No, what's your last name? That's your middle name. No. Look, okay. okay. It's Maria. Marie Tia. Why, why not? Oh, man. Just call me late for dinner. Ron says yeah. the creamy fits perfectly. You just realized I have I've mainly all ninja appliances. Ooh. Air fryer, blender, now creamy. Use and love them all. That's our only appliance. Danita says I looked for Cremona on Amazon. Didn't find it. So it's creamy. C-R-E-A-M-I. It's kind of weird. And the better place to find it is um, Kohl's, Bed Bath & Beyond, mm -hmm. or... H-M-N? Um, Home Shopping Network has Oh, that's well. what that is. Yeah. The one on HSN has five bowls instead of the normal three. Amazon's out of stock. Like, a lot of places are out of stock, and so that's where we've been able to find it. So, yep. look, the HMN one. HSN. Whatever I keep saying wrong. CNN. CNS. <laughs> Randall, computer navigation system. And Or the Kohl's one. I don't know if that's the five bowls, but there is a coupon, so you could save some money doing those two ways. Yeah. Um, let's see. Bry says, great morning, y'all. Who made it? Hope everyone's having a fantastic morning. Hi, Brian. Uh, let's see. Betsy says, if I can pick a new name, it would be Matreya. Love that name. Right. I love uh, that person. Fat Unicorn says, hubby is, was going to take my la my name, Brown, but his ver given first name is Charlie. Charlie Brown? No. no. So that didn't work. I'm stuck with McAnally. Never be pronounced correctly. Uh, Michelle says, my daughter came home from college and asked me when Ninja is going to start sponsoring our kitchen since we have everything Ninja appliance. <laughs> no kidding. Hey, like, why are they not sponsoring more kitchens around the world? What the heck? All right. Well, thank you, everybody, for joining us. Uh, we'll be doing our live stream again tomorrow morning. Mm -hmm. From our house. Hopefully from our house. Clean. Yep. Chris usually cleans it. That's a good job. No, I usually just move stuff out of the way, out of frame. That's so. a good job to me. All right. Have a great day, everybody. Bye. Bye.